Hey guys, thanks for joining me for another Dokkan Battle video, and today uh, I really like Dragon Ball Saga here, so I'm going to see if I can't get a Dragon Ball Saga team through like one of the more modern Red Zone stages. So we're going to try Cell Max Red Zone and see if I can beat it with a full Dragon Ball Saga team. This team includes three free-to-play units, by the way. We've got LR Jackie Chun, we've got Grandpa Gohan, and we've got Yamcha. So sure, let's hop in. I don't know how well this is going to go. Um, I haven't actually attempted this off camera. I'm doing this right now just while recording. Um, if I die like instantly, like I'll jump in and use a few attempts and see if we can't get it done, right? So we'll see here. Uh, I do need to turn auto battling off, though. I do not want to try to auto battle this. I don't think I'm that good. Um, all right, so starting off with AGL phase with Grandpa Gohan. That's not good. Are we just going to instantly die? Because I can't just use items all right. Well, I guess I could use items because it's only one phase, right? So... Because Grandpa Gohan can only guard if our HP is 58% or less. So I might actually have to float Grandpa Gohan here and just do the two kid Gokus, which I know isn't ideal, but Grandpa Gohan's going to get slaughtered. Any damage reduction I can get here would be good, but six orbs looks like it's what we're going to get here. Ah, uh, oh, we're not going to get damage reduction with either Goku. That's kind of unfortunate. Okay, well, we might just die to turn one. I will use a Whis right away just because Grandpa Gohan's got type disadvantage. It's a tough fight to navigate because he changes typings every turn, right? So uh, let's hope if a super comes, it comes on one of these Gokus. With Whis, I think we should be fine here. We'll see how it goes. Uh, but yeah, having two physical Kid Gokus on rotation was not, not ideal here. This wasn't a good uh, turn one. If Grandpa Gohan would have even been just type neutral, I probably would have been fine putting him in slot two with the Whis on, but... Um, there's a lot of attacks coming in slot two, so we're gonna have to float Grandpa Gohan. Because uh, I do think I eventually want Grandpa Gohan like on rotation with like one of the Kid Gokus, and then I'm gonna obviously Hachan with the other one. Um, now it worked out here where Hachan is gonna end up with no Kid Gokus. Like this is just the worst setup. Cause <laughs> yeah, this is terrible. And I didn't even float off a Kid Goku, so I've now I've got to float Hachan next turn just to get him with the Kid Goku. This might just be a dead run because the rotation was so bad. But on global, we still have limited turn or limited attempts. So I'm going to attempt this, but normally I probably would have just reset this one like right away. I guess Jackie Chun in slot one here looks good. Um, we do still have Whis active, but we're not getting much damage down here on cell. Um, yeah, let's see. I'm going to try to set up to have like big patches of orbs here so that Goku can actually get damage reduction. Yeah, Jackie Chun not even taken there. I mean, his defense going up on getting hit looking better. But yeah, had we got supered right away, that wouldn't have been pretty because this is with a Whis on. This might be one of those runs where I just have to like back-to-back -back Whis until we can get somewhat properly set up and then just hope we don't die after that. That's probably the best plan here because there's no point in risking it because it's not like we have another phase coming, right? Like this is the cell immediately. All right, what's Yamcha going to take here? I did give him some dodge, but it didn't come through. 272 with the Whis. Yeah, we pretty much need to ride Whis. Wow, and then 60k normals. All right, so... Uh, there's a reason why Dragon Ball Saga isn't top tier right now, but I want to see if we can get him through. This could be fun. All right, so now we got just the Mega Kid Go. Like, nobody links at all with anybody ever. Um, I Yeah, I mean, we might as well pop active skills, though, right? Uh, no reason not to. So, sure, let's use In Kid Goku here. Very nice. Oh, love this animation. Yeah, not much damage. Not uh, STR Kaioken Goku level, we'll say that much. I want to change my settings here really quick while I'm in it. Um, let's go to active skill once per day. Once per day. I'm going to do once per day on those. All right. Um, yeah, we're, let's pop a Kid Goku as well. I mean, a physical Kid Goku. I mean, we might as well pop them all. Uh, but I just put on once per day, so then when I activate the second one, this won't pop twice. But we might as well just throw everything out here. Why not? So that is the one thing with In Kid Goku, right? Is that um, you can do his active skill right away. Like there's no turn count on it. I'm sure let's pop the other one here. We got type advantage. It's a good turn to do it. All right. And uh, we need to Whis again. And then hope hope we can get some orbs to heal up. Okay. So there's seven orbs. And then we're in a situation where there's almost too, almost too many rainbows. I'm um, sure let's grab this. And it would be nice to get some physical. Yeah, there we go. Some physical with some orbs. All right, let's try that. Get a little bit of damage reduction here at least, right? All right, and then we're getting a dodge. And then 
I mean, with Whis and a little bit of damage reduction, I think we're okay here. Yeah, double digits, that's good. And we got a decent amount of orbs, right? So 5 mil for the friend Goku. Okay. And another 5 mil. We'll take it. <laughs> Alright, I mean, this is the phase we got to get damage in, right? And then 7.2 for the easy A one here. And then guarantee crits because of the active skill, right? So these are going to hit nice. Even this normal here, yep. Okay. Oh, another suit. That's right, this Selkin multi-super. What's in Kid Goku going to take? We've got Whis on. Yeah, okay, double digits. And we have that little bit of damage reduction too. Very good. All right, so this, this worked out. Now we have to hope that like within the next two turns we can really heal up and then be able to put like Aider in front of like Cell Max and stuff, right? So we're going to have um, Whis for the next turn. And then when Whis falls off, we should have an Aider turn. And then we can hope that we're kind of good there. We'll see, and then we're just going to be crossing our fingers the rest of the way, but we got Cell Max halfway dead, so Dragon Ball Saga actually holding out pretty decent here, right? All right, now we got an STR phase. All right, so, I mean, Jackie Chun, God, I don't even remember what his active skill does. Oh, yeah, it's a big nuke. And then he's got a lot of crit chances, okay. And then he's got damage reduction, right? Oh, after he supers him, he reduces. So slot one isn't going to be the greatest. Who's the best defensively? I mean, Jackie Chun is still the best defensively here. Um, sure, let's do this. Let's pop Jackie Chun here. We just have to hope that the Whis is enough to hold out. We got to get some healing, man. The orbs just have not worked out for healing. The problem is I think we're making too many rainbow orbs and we don't have enough type orbs out there. Just, we had that su such a bad rotation. Like, if we get this, it would be, like, in spite of the terrible rotations we've had, right? We're just going to try it like this and hope that we can get a little bit of healing here. Oofta, and then Yamcha. And Yamcha's not even at max capacity here because we don't have a peppy guy. Yeah, super right away. We're probably just dead here. Let's see. 262. Pretty darn close. Oh, clutch dodge. Are we taken from normals? Yeah, we're dead. Okay, let's just hop in again, dude. I actually feel okay about how this team did. We just had terrible rotation. Like, we didn't get one legit turn with Aider, who's like the best defensive unit on the team. So let's try it again. Oh, and of course, it, like, didn't remember my team. I That's one thing I want Dokkan to fix, is if you do an attempt and either abandon or fail, like, it should still keep the team up there, right? All right, let's see if this is a little bit better. Yeah, we've had... Yeah, this is a lot more reasonable, because we have, like, one of my main rotations right away, which I think I want, you know, Int Kid Goku... Or a kid Goku with Grandpa Gohan, right? All right, so this is AGL. So yeah, we'll do this. We are just gonna pop Whis right away. I feel like we just have to with this team. It's just how it's gonna be. And then we just see. But I'm hoping that you know next turn we're gonna have an Aider turn with Physical Goku. Maybe well we'll still be under Whis, but hopefully I can get into like one of their turns and like not have to use a Whis. <clears throat> Let's see how this turn how how this run goes. I think this run will be a little bit better. Okay. The one thing that this team does have is we do have a lot of active skill damaging attacks, right? The three Kid Gokus and the Jackie Chun all have like active skill attacks. All right, we've got Whis. We've already supered. I think we're going to be fine here. Yeah, double digits. Okay. Grandpa Gohan putting in some work here. Let's see. Hopefully Grandpa Gohan also does not get supered. Oh, 100k normals. Oh, a clutch dodge. Wow, 100k normals for Grandpa Gohan. Yikes. Yeah, he's definitely a riskier play here, that's for sure. You know, I probably could have brought, like, Physical Bama, who's got dodging. She maybe maybe would make more sense, because then um, Yamcha gets the full buff. If we have to go in again, I might try that. Yeah, double digits for Jackie Chun, looking good. Because Jackie Chun did get to attack at 50% damage reduction, right? Jackie Chun's legit. Like, he's good. All right. Um, Aider now, he doesn't guard, I don't believe, right? Yeah, plus... And he doesn't have full damage direction. We gotta go five turns. I think... Well, we've got Whis on, though. So I think I actually am okay just leaving Aider there. Because with the Whis damage reduction, yeah, he's gonna be fine. Even type disadvantage. And we've got seven orbs, so more damage reduction. Yeah, alright. This... 
This run's feeling a lot better. Now, Yamcha could definitely get clocked, but I did build him full dodge just for this type of situation, right? So, aider has got the defense buff. Yeah, I think with all the damage reduction, we're absolutely fine here. We have way too much damage reduction. Yeah, double digits. We're good. Okay. All right. This is good. This is good. And then four mil for Aider. Yeah, I think that's the one change I might make is maybe swap out Grandpa Gohan for physical Bulma just because she's got some inherent dodge. And then Yamcha's support will be a little bit better. That's maybe what I'll have to do. Let's see, though. We might be able to get through with this team here. Okay. We need the we need the kid Goku's to carry the damage here. Yeah, and Yamcha at 3.6, even without Bulma. So like I did a showcase on him, and if you've got Peppy Gals, like he's hitting over four mil attack stats, but even 3.6. Definitely fine with the support. Oh, and of course he tags Yamcha. This is gonna sting. He did not dodge. Okay, 180, actually not the worst. He's got decent defense. Okay. Um, so now this turn here. Oh, I cannot put Grandpa Gohan in front of all those. I've got to float Grandpa Gohan. Um, actually, in Kid Goku, and he's got, okay, in Kid Goku, he's got a really good amount of defense right now, and I think physical Kid Goku, I'd rather have him in slot one, because he's got type advantage, he's going to be guarding. I don't know that I can get seven orbs, even if I drop them down. I mean, I think if I get the green, there could be enough int that drop down. No, I feel more comfortable with physical Goku in slot one, I think. And then we'll do Ink Kid Goku will grab all this. And then I'm going to risk this turn without an item. I think I am. I don't know. Grandpa Gohan, though, has taken like 100k normals before. Uh, with a Weeson. Hmm. I'm going to risk it this turn. And just pray that Grandpa Gohan dodges or just takes a normal for like 200k. <laughs> we'll see. Uh, of course, Cell only doing one attack probably is planning a uh, super attack there. We'll see. We'll see. We got to take down Cell Max with the Dragon Ball Saga. We got to do it. All right, five mil here. What I love about this Kid Goku is like between all the orb changing and support, it's just awesome. I love leaders that support. It's one of my favorites. I just Dragon Ball Saga just needs a bit more. Like one or two more premium units or easy A's would really help. Because you can see, I've, I'm running quite a few free-to-play units on this team. Just because their summonable options are not that great. Alright, uh, now this is without Whis. But Goku had 400k defense. Yeah, 100k, he can take those all day. Give me another one, just do another one, then Grandpa Gohan's safe. Alright, we're praying that Grandpa Gohan does not get super. He's going to take a lot of damage even on a normal here, I think. Let's see what happens. Oh my gosh, are you kidding me right now? The one attack in slot 3 and you're going to hit Grandpa Gohan. For 500k, sure. Okay, let's go in for our last attempt. Um, I think I'm going to swap him for Physical Bulma. I think that's what I'm going to do. Wow, that's just like the worst luck. Uh, so even with a Whis there, it would have been like 100k or whatever. Yeah, let's do Physical Bulma. Let's try this team. I think I feel a little bit better about this team here. <laughs> All right. And Bulma needs to build up through dodging and defense. Like, so the, what makes Cell Max hard is you're getting the final boss right away. Like, there's no time to, like, build up. Um, so what I'm going to do here... Let me see what's lined up. Okay, I'm going to do this. And I am going to put Bulma in slot 1. I know it seems crazy. I'm going to use a Whis. And then I'm hoping that he'll do some normals. And that she can build up um, her defense through getting hit and dodging. Because she gets two passives, one on dodging and one on getting hit. So we need her to do both. Uh, I'm sure we'll do that and leave some physical orbs for Goku. We're probably going to need to heal. Super right away, of course. How about a dodge Bulma? No. Okay, we got Whis, though. I mean, her defense is not crazy right now. Yeah, 300k with a Whis. Of course, before she gets a chance to build anything up, and then she dodges the normals. This The RNG in this game can be so frustrating, I tell you. Because right And another super? And she... <laughs> She dodges both of the normals and takes both of the supers and darn near gets us killed. Wow. And I have no healing items. So now I've got to ride Whis the rest of the way. And uh, hope that we can heal up through orbs. That, that is so unfortunate. Why couldn't it have been the reverse where she took the normals and then dodged the supers? That is so stupid. <laughs> the RNG, I tell you. That was just like a slap in the face. That is crazy. This could almost just be a meme video showing, like, the worst RNG you can possibly have. 
I might upload this even if I lose. Just because the RNG is so terrible. <laughs> yeah, this might be like a showcase of the worst RNG <laughs> you can have. Wow. All right, so now we've got Aider. Um, <laughs> yeah, and of course we've got active skills, of course. Um, sure, let's just pop it. Okay. Um, so I am going to use a Whis because I just can't take like... An oh no, I was on a Whis turn already. I just wasted it. Um, hold on, I'm going to soft reset that. <laughs> I'm going to soft reset that. Because I was already on a Whis. I do not want to waste that Whis there. Yeah, we got a soft reset right there. We're we're not doing any edits here. We just jump in raw. You know how it goes. Uh, let's just hop back in. Yes, I would like to continue. Thank you. Okay. So we will still pop the active skill. I am going to leave Aider in slot one because with Weiss's damage reduction, we saw this last run, he's fine. Um, we're going to do this. Actually, I kind of want physical Goku in slot one because we've got eight. Yeah, we got to do Goku in slot one. Look at all those orbs. We need all the healing we can get. Um, we need the int orbs for Jackie Chun. We need as much healing as we possibly can get here. Oh, and of course they fall really wonky for me. That's unfortunate, but we'll take that. All right, and then next turn, we'll Whis. Uh, I, I was really expecting him just to instantly super me. I'm not going to lie. All right, so Goku at 8 mil here. We need, to, we need to push the damage through. It's kind of funny. My best run so far was that first run with just terrible rotations. Like, the last run was fine. I just took one little risk on one singular attack, and of course, it was a super, and he didn't dodge it. It's just how it goes, right? All right, Aider got his hit to build up. That's good. Jackie Chun is going to hit him first, guaranteed a 50% damage reduction. He's Jackie Chun is actually a pretty darn quality unit for this team. Like, he is awesome. Like, this is going to do nothing because we've got Whis plus his own damage reduction plus Goku's damage reduction. It's darn near 100% damage reduction. Yeah, no chance. And then he's building up defense on getting hit, which is good. Okay, so now we're on to the next Whis turn. Um, let me see what Bulma's looking. Let's pop this. And then what is Bulma looking like? Because she did build up quite a bit. She dodged and got... Where's she at? 200k defense only. I mean, she does have type advantage this time. I might actually leave Bulma in slot 1 again. Let me just see what I got for orbs. Okay, I'm going to grab this and hope that it drops in a way that Goku can get 8 or 7. There's 7. Yep, we'll take that. Oh, it sucks, though. I had to grab the STR orb, so Yamcha can't heal now. All right, let's just hope we survive this. We'll see. All right, yeah, Bulma's still building up. Dodging, getting hit. Yeah, just keep building up, Bulma. That's fine. But yeah, and she can hit decent numbers, right? Like, this physical Bulma is interesting. There, now we're getting additionals. Now Bulma's cooking a little bit. Putting in some good work here. All right, now she's fully built up. So if we get to another turn, I would be curious to see what her stats are looking like. Okay, and Yamcha's going to be looking a little bit better having a Bulma on the team or a Peppy Gale. So we'll take that. Okay, big crit there. Man, we don't even have him halfway dead yet, though. We're going to need some RNG to go back in our favor in the second half of this fight. All right, Goku should be fine here. Not worried about this at all. That worked out well putting Bulma in slot one. That did work out. Yamcha had 3.6. Okay. Yamcha, just don't get incinerated, please. And have your actual dodge come through for me. I gave you full dodge, so please actually dodge. Okay, a dodge. Okay, 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 okay. All right, so we're into another turn here. I think we're still under Whis. Um, yep, okay, and we've got the really good Goku Hachan rotation, so we're going to do this. Okay, ooh, uh, the Int Orbs. Yeah, um, yes, let's grab this. And then Int Goku. Actually, we're going to be good on health now. That's good. All right, yeah, we're about full healed. All right, we're in a good spot, and we got him about halfway dead. The only thing is, so we're basically, like, starting over at this point. We've got him halfway dead. The big problem is, is we don't have any more items. So now we're just crossing our fingers the whole time. We're hoping that units dodge for us or that the right units get supered. Provided that only, like, Kid Goku or Hachan get supered, like, we'll be fine. And then, you know, Yamcha's got dodge, Bulma's got dodge. We just need them to actually do it. Like, this should be fine. <laughs> Should be good here. I guess it also depends on Cell's typing. That can definitely play a role in what happens. For sure. And with him changing every turn, it gets dicey. All right. Oh, man, we're so close. I would love to get this run done in this video, you guys. Would love to get the Dragon Ball Saga done here. 
Let's go. Man, a lot of attacks coming. I mean, he's got good defense, though. I think we'd be fine on a super. All right. I feel like Cell's going to super us a lot this turn. And, of course, this is kind of like my yucky turn. Ah, Jackie Chun with type disadvantage. This could get ugly here. Um, we definitely want Goku in slot one. We've got eight orbs, so let's do that. And let's just hope Goku gets pummeled. Or Bulma, if she gets it, she dodges. Or, I mean, Jackie Chun will have damage reduction, but, man... I mean, so he's going to have 58% damage reduction, but he's type disadvantage. I just really don't want Jackie Chun to get supered. He does have dodge because he's int, but it's not a heavy amount of dodge. I don't know. I definitely see the path to this being doable. Like, I think this is doable, and we're pretty darn close. I'm hoping we can get it in this video. Kid Goku, carry me, please. Let's get it done, Kid Goku. Okay. Oh, man, we're so close, you guys. And next turn should be a pretty safe turn, except for my slot 3 unit. Bulma at 5. Oh, I forgot to check her defense. 5 mil for Bulma. No additionals. All right, dodge. Yes. All right, Bulma. That's what you're supposed to do. Now the RNG turning. Um, Yeah, the RNG turning back. All right, now we need Jackie Chu not to get supered. If he does, his damage reduction could still be enough. Nope, 28k normals. Not enough. All right, we were still building defense there. All right. We, okay, RNG turning back in our favor. Oh no, AGL against Yamcha. And of course, only one attack, but you know what's going to happen. Y'all know what's going to happen. All right, Hachan looking pretty good. We're going to leave him in slot one. Um, I don't need to worry about healing, so I'm going to go for the most orbs. So we can get eight orbs here for Goku. Yamcha can just grab whatever. I'm um, sure, let's grab this. And then we'll have a lot of physical for Goku next turn, provided we can survive. That's just, if we, basically, if Yamcha doesn't get supered, I think we're going to live. Because Yamcha's not taking a 500k normal. Hachan getting supered is awesome. If he can get two supers out of the way here on Hachan and Goku, we'll take it. Okay, 4.6. All right. Dude, we might actually get this, you guys. Come on now. Come on now. Full Dragon Ball Saga versus Cell Max. Let's go. Uh, I really want Cell Max to uh, super there. Hopefully he supers Kid Goku. If we if he supers Yamcha and he doesn't dodge, I'm going to be so mad. I am going to be so mad. Dude, we almost got this. If this is a crit, like it's not going to kill him, but pretty darn close. Oh my gosh, we're getting there. All right, dude, this better not be a super on Yamcha. If this is a super, I'm going to be so mad. I'm going to upload this video either way. Please dodge it if it's a super. Oh, Yamcha, you're making me nervous. Okay, he dodged it anyways, and it was a normal. Okay, we're really close, you guys. All right, we're ending on a tech phase. In Goku in slot one, I would actually be fine with. So, Bulma at the end does worry me. Oh, we got to do physical in slot one. Look at all this physical orbs here. All right, so we're going to do this. I, I think just the two kid... I'm, I'm banking on... Bulma not even taking damage here because I'm banking on the enemy uh, Cell Max dying before she gets a turn. Um, if Bulma gets attacked, I guess it's unfortunate and we hope she dodges out. She's got 258k defense, not really enough defense, but we're just going to hope she dodges out. But I think we can just hopefully take him out here. We might have Cell Max done with full Dragon Ball Saga, you guys. All right, let's go, let's go. Okay. Yep. Oh. <laughs> I think we got this. Come on, Int Kid Goku. We didn't get any additionals with physical, but dude, just Int Goku, take him out. Type advantage. Six mil. This has got to do it. If not, give me an additional. Let's go. Oh, so close, but Bulma should be able to finish. Yeah, Bulma. He literally... Oh, no. Goku's going to finish. I was going to say, he has a sliver, uh, but we got it, you guys. So, full Dragon Ball Saga, beating one of the newest red zones in the game, so there you go. I just had to show that off. I love Dragon Ball Saga. And there you go. They are red zone viable, the Dragon Ball Saga team. So anyways, guys, let me know what you think of this run. Let me know what you think of Dragon Ball Saga. Thanks for watching. We'll catch y'all on the next one.